one particular day, I had a message by Terry Savey. She said, if you are organized, that is the beginning of your success. It took me time to believe this. Then one day I asked myself, is it really true that getting organized is the main source of your success? If you are like me and you are asking the same question, let's get into today's topic. And let me share if this statement is true with you. Keep watching. Hello everyone, my name is Avalake Janet Oyelami. Thanks for coming back to watch my video. And if this channel is impacting you in one way or the other, please subscribe, like this video and share with others to impact them more. If you are wondering like me, being organized, how can it be the main source of your success? Well, before I continue in today's topic, let me give the keyword that summarizes today's topic. Today's keyword say, when Lucifer, Satan was sent out of heaven because he wanted to be like God, immediately he fell into the world. The first thing he did was to scatter the world. When God came down to check the world before he started the creation, God noticed the world was upside down and disorganized. Then he started the creation and saw that all he created was good. Friends, how tidy and neat are you, both in the house, in the car, at the office, and in your dressing? Being organized is next to God. Being neat is one of God's character. Get organized first in your house, clean up regularly. This will attract success to you. Now, what exactly is the meaning of being organized? Organization is the idea of putting things together in a logical order. Add benefit of being organized, stress relief, an endless list of things to do constantly looming over you is often the source of stress in your life. Number two benefit, sleep better. Even if you don't realize it, clutter in your bedroom can cause you to lose out on sleep. Healthier lifestyle, be more productive at work. By keeping organized, you will save time looking for things and we have more time to work on important tasks. As organization can improve the flow of communication between you and your team, you can also make your team more productive. After all, better communication leads to better results. So, what exactly are you supposed to do to start attracting success? Number one, looking good attracts success. Even if you are going for shopping, look good in a simple manner. Even if you are in your house, dress smartly in a simple manner. I will give this example. When I was young, looking for a teaching job, I went to a nursery. My dressing that day was just simple top and trouser. And when I got to the headmistress, she looked at me and she said, What is my name? I told her my name. And she said, you know what? I'm not going to interview you. Merely looking at the way you are dressed up, I'm going to employ you. And that was how I got the job. I got the job, salary started to come in. Your dressing attracts success. The second way to start getting organized, which will lead to your success, is arrange your shoe in order. You might laugh and say, oh dear, what am I saying? You might be surprised over this number two. Let me tell you, as you arrange your shoe in an orderly manner, it goes to your brain, it goes to your subconscious mind, and when you do that on a regular basis, it will show in your work. After many months of arranging your shoe in an orderly manner, it goes straight to your subconscious mind, it goes straight to your brain, and Anything you start to do, maybe at work at, and at business, 
you will just start to notice that you are organized in all that areas of life. And when you get organized, people around you, your colleague, your clients, we get to notice it and they will say, I prefer having business with this particular person because of what? He or she is very organized and by this, Sussex is being attracted to you. Number three, organize your receipt in your purse. Maybe you went to shopping and you quickly got your receipt from the till. Squeeze it into your purse. That shows that you are yet to be organized. An organized person will take the receipt, fold it nicely and put it in their purse. Like I said earlier, the more you do this, the more it goes to your subconscious mind. The more you start to get organized, the more you start to go to work on time, the more you start to start your business on time, the more you start to keep the time whenever you have appointment with your client. And when you do this, people will want to come close to you to have business with you. Number four, organize all your clothes. Sally Savage said, a mother always washed the clothes of the family members and dumped it on the bed. They continued with their lifestyle and remained afraid for many years. Then one day she was asking God, God bless my family. And God told her, start folding the clothes on your bed and put them in the right place. He said, how can that be the voice of God? How can folding clothes bring blessing to me? She asked God. But she obeyed and started folding the cloth every time she washed it. She noticed that ideas began to come to her. She started to get organized at work. She started to get organized at the service in the church. And that was how their life turned around. Now, do you agree with me that getting organized in all these areas of life will attract success to you? My conclusion is this. When you get organized in all areas of your life, you will get this success. More customer if you're a business person. You will get effective results over your job at work and that will lead to promotion. Remember, when God finished everything he created from day one to day six, he looked at it and he said, they are good. This simply means organization skill started from God and which led to the success of the world creation. So get organized in all these areas of your life and start attracting the success you need. Hope this impacts you. Hope this encourages you to run after your dream. Speak to you soon. God bless.